Hey guys, welcome back. This is Mike. Uh, I gotta apologize up front. We've shipped two or three sets of packages since the last video that I did on YouTube for things we've shipped out for customers. Uh, several, many, many dash bezels, probably 15 to 20, and probably five or ten sets of rim lights. Um, just got a lot of stuff going on. Um, December was busy, as you know, for Christmas, but amazingly enough, January has been even more busy. So, um, along with everything that I do here in the shop for all my other customers, uh, for those of you who don't know, I have my own projects going on. Yeah, imagine that, right? And so, uh, a part of it, and I have a head cold, so forgive me, but a part of it is a Suzuki street bike build that we've been doing for several months. Um, all the way down to the frame, back up, new motor, uh, new exhaust. Uh, we're actually doing another new exhaust. Um, and just a ton, ton of work. Um, I had a set of uh, katana rims that we sent out to Chrome Pros out in Texas a couple weeks ago. Uh, they brought them back in about two weeks and had them chromed and, you know, looking all, looking really, really good and stuff. So I'll go over that here in just a moment. Uh, we've got some uh, Sporttech Mitzer M3s going on them. Uh, the fairings are all being painted some candy. I don't know what color yet. For those on Facebook who follow me, uh, there were two different sets of candy colors that we did. We actually did five sets, and we're only picking two, and I haven't really finalized on those yet. But So anyway, two sets of full fairings, fuel tank, uh, windshield, which is what you're looking at here. All that's getting painted. Um, hydrographics, uh, airbrush, I mean, just the, the whole nine. It's going to look really, really awesome. And um, got, you know, some rim lights going on it. It's, it's going to be really, really spectacular. We're getting ready for bike week coming up in May. And so our deadline is, is rapidly approaching. So I want to go over this real quick. <clears throat> this is just some of the things that came in. Uh, the mail carriers dropped off today, UPS dropped off this uh, Zero Gravity Sports Touring windshield. Alright, now I've already got one of these, and um, this one here, uh, I actually paid full price for my first one, which is about 90 bucks, a smoked one. And this one here I actually picked up off eBay for about 30 bucks, brand new, from Sports Touring Outlet. Alright, and this was a second run, it had a blim in it, so they say... I cannot find any issue wrong with it. Um, not that it makes much difference because it's going to get primed and painted anyway. So even if there was a huge scratch in it, it wouldn't make a difference for me. But kudos to them. Really fast shipping. A freaking awesome price on this. I really wish that I had bought my first one from them instead of spending the 90 bucks that I did. Not that nothing was wrong with it. It's a great windshield. But... Um, for the price, I mean, this was one third the cost. So, kudos to them. You know, uh, zero gravity. Gotta love those windshields. They're really good. Um, <clears throat> some of the things that we're painting on the bike. Not only are the fairings, um, the gas tank, the windshield, um, various other small pieces on the bike, um, the sprockets, um, a lot of your fair. We got brand new chrome fairing bolts that are a dress kit for the bike. Um, the top triple clamp, uh, because we swapped out from the original bolt-on bars to uh, tree clip-on bars, the uh, original top triple has the original clamps, and I got two sets of those, and I basically put them in the machine shop, and we milled them down smooth to where they were just, you know, really smooth like this, and um, we're going to, you know, prime and paint those again two sets for two different colors and basically we can interchange everything on the bike in just a matter of minutes and uh, make it look like a totally different bike so it's really cool I actually have two sets of forks <clears throat> the lower tubes are going to get painted so really really cool really awesome looking forward to it and picking out those candy colors um, matter of fact these are the uh, dust seals and forks fork seals that came in today um, these actually came from the UK uh, because they're so hard to find um, over here in a full set. So the other thing, um, some new grips. Uh, these are actually going to get taken apart and get painted. Um, as you can see right here, the metal parts. All these are going to get taken off. They're not going to be black. So we're going to redo all of that. Um, these two metal pieces here that you see, this is actually 
from Chucky81 over on gstwins.com. And I'll put a link in here for guys who are interested. He does some really awesome work. Now, these are billet aluminum. All right. Um, I mean, you can see how thick that is. I mean, I'm a guess half inch. Um, I haven't put a caliper on it, but I mean, they're really nice. These are obviously CNC done. Uh, he engraves them with the Suzuki logo if you want that. If not, then you know, he'll just leave it blank and it'll look just like that pretty much. Um, so that's the fork brace. And of course, this is the side engine cover. Uh, so this is actually going to get painted with the rest of the bike. Uh, it's going to stand out a little bit. But you can see really, you know, just how, how awesome that work is. Really, really sharp. Sharp, good work. Um, it's really detailed, really thick. Um, I mean, it's, uh, honestly, I don't know how he, make, how he makes any money on these, really. And, you know, I know CNC, uh, you know, you have your program set up, you push your button and off it goes. <clears throat> but your material cost and everything, I mean, that's just not thin metal. So kudos to him for that. Really appreciate it. Um, like I said, the rims we sent out to Chrome Pros, those are back. We got all our lights for the bike. We got all the fairings. Um, I got the grips. I got the top clamps. We got the uh, windshields. Uh, I got tires. New chain sprockets are coming in. Um, I mean, geez, a ton of piece, a ton of work. Um, matter of fact, I'm working with a guy here locally. We're doing a custom exhaust on it. True Duel. Um, well, I say true dual. It'll have an H pipe in it for equalization, but it'll be all new pipes, all new headers, custom bent. And we're going to mount two Yoshimura, Yoshimura, Mura, however you pronounce it, TRS stainless um, mufflers on those. So that's really going to be cool. That's going to be a one off piece. Um, I've never seen it on, you know, this particular Suzuki. So, yeah, we'll see. Hopefully it'll sound good. It'll definitely look good. Uh, even if it looks good and it sounds the same as one, I'm not going to be disappointed because just from the coolness factor of having it done and it looking really cool. Um, you know, as well as pieces like these, it just brings out the bike even more. So, um, anyway, kind of ranted and, and, you know, raved a little bit enough about all these pieces. Um, stay tuned. If you're not on Facebook, check me out on Facebook. There's pictures going up all the time of our work, uh, the hydrographics, the custom paint, uh, new SATA jet guns coming in tomorrow. Uh, hopefully, uh, new LED light bars are coming in tomorrow. We've got some 7.5s. We've got 13.5s, 21.5s, um, 31.5s, 41.5s, and I can get 50 or 52-inch bars. But I've definitely got all those others coming in. I've got everything coming in except 50s. Um, but all those are pretty much already sold. We did a group by for a group of guys over on uh, ramtalkin.com. So check that out. Really good site. Lots of cool guys. Uh, we're going to do some more group buys on there for those lights as well as our bezels. Uh, so guys can get a group discount on buying those because we're selling multiples at a time so check that out um sun's going down temperatures dropping kind of spoke enough about all these all these just miscellaneous pieces but um guys check out chucky 81 on gs twins if you're looking for a piece and um other than that you guys have a great day thanks for watching the video stay tuned for more i promise it gets more exciting and uh, you guys have a great evening